You've got some real guts, you know that? Oh, the captain's gonna make you pay for what you did. Dearly. So this is the guy, huh? His power level's around 5,000. Just like we said, makes no sense, right? Absurd. Relying too much on your scouter is a rookie mistake. Don't be a fool. Most likely, he has the ability to instantly increase his power. From what I can tell, I'd say his true power level is somewhere around 60,000. 60,000? Saints don't have that much power? Promising. This'll be an enjoyable battle, the first in a long time. All right, let's do this, Vegeta. You take that smaller guy over there. Kakarot and Ginyu are more or less equal in terms of power. If I'm lucky enough, maybe the two of them might take each other out. This is the end of the line for you. I'm gonna whip that ass! Kakarot! Vegeta! Here I go! Oh, you a bitch, Vegeta. Man, I can't believe Vegeta ditched me like that. I know I just got here, but let's get this show on the road. But not for long. The mighty Captain Ginyu will put you in your place. Ah! I see. This guy's a lot more capable than he looks. Yeah, 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 how can the Saiyan be this true? Unbelievable! Come on! It's my turn now! Just so you know, you haven't seen all my power. Not even close. <laughs> what? Some of this Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my Your 
gonna command me to finish it off. Are you? No, no, you can't be. Are you? Are you a Super Saiyan? Vegeta said something about that too. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. S S Super Saiyan? You mean? You mean the legendary warrior? Who? No! This cannot be! Is this guy really the only thing in the universe that even Lord Frieza is afraid of? I don't know about that, but what I do know is that I'd like to avoid fighting if I can. So listen up. Just leave the planet. I'm saying this for your own good. <laughs> what? Are you... Choking? No, I'm serious. I don't want to kill you guys if I don't have to. I've heard that the Super Saiyan is the ultimate warrior. One that lives only for battle and bloodshed. Oh, oh I get it. You're not actually a Super Saiyan, are you? But be that as it may, your power is still far greater than my own power. <laughs> <laughs> Change. I fucking hate this part. What's funny? <sighs> Jace, take my scouter. What? What are you doing? <laughs> that body of yours is pretty strong. Yes, and I think I'll take it. Change! God damn it. God damn it! I wish I could fast forward through this part. I fucking hate this part. It's so gonna go. You seem to get my Vegeta down. What? What's going on? What? What? What am I doing all the way over there? We've made a trade. Your body is mine now. Hey, Captain, here's your skin. Mm. Right. Now, back to the ship. It's possible Lord Frieza may have returned already. <laughs> That's that bullshit. So this is why he damaged his own body. It all makes sense now. I'm in serious trouble. If I don't hurry, I'm... Wait, no. He's gonna meet up with Krillin and the others. That's it. Wait a second. Even if I make it back to Earth, Chi-Chi probably wouldn't be all too happy seeing me the way I am right now. Stop bullshit! He seems to have sniffed us out. It won't be much longer until he's here. You must go, Dinle. Unhurry. Those Earthlings need you. Uh, okay. I understand, but please don't die, Grand Elder Guru. I suppose I'll let this one live. There's no sense wasting my time with a single speck of dust. What do you want? Greetings and salutations. My name is Frieza, and I've come to your humble little planet in search of the Dragon Balls. Fear not, as I have already managed to gather all seven of them. Though it would seem I am unable to draw upon their power, which is what brings me to the lot of you. Tell me what I must do in order to grant my wish. I suggest you leave. We have no intention of telling monsters like you. I would be more forthcoming if I were you. Although I do not intend to kill you, I will use force if necessary. There are two of you, yes. 
I don't care which one of you it is, but one of you will tell me. Fine. If that's how it's going to be, then we'll fight. But know this. Grand Elder Guru, the creator of the Dragon Balls, resides here. If you kill him, the Dragon Balls will disappear as well. Hmm? Nail, my son. You must hold him off as long as you can. Understood, my lord. I see. But I'm curious. Don't you wonder if he'll still refuse to tell me what I need to know when he sees that you're about to die? I won't go down as easy as you think. But we're not going to fight here. Grand Elder Guru doesn't have much longer to live. Fighting here would only hasten his end. Oh, ho, 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 ho. very well then. You can do it, Nail. Oh my, that's quite impressive. You've somehow managed to raise your power level to 42,000. Such a feat for the likes of you. But just to give you a sense of scale, allow me to inform you of what you're truly up against. My power level, you see, is 530,000. Well, shit. Rest assured, however, I haven't the slightest intention of fighting you with my full power. How kind of me. That's enough! <laughs> Where are the Dragon Balls? They're either hidden somewhere, or Frieza's holding on to them. Wherever they are, those Earthlings are sure to find them with that contraption of theirs. But before they get the chance, I must mask my power. They'll quickly realize I'm here otherwise. This should work. Once those runs summon that Shenron creature, I'll kill them and get my wish granted. It won't be long until I run into them. I should change into a new battle suit while I have the chance. New battle armor. Krillin! The Dragon Balls are over there! Gotcha! Let's go, Gohan! The radar's showing that the Dragon Balls aren't in the ship, but somewhere near it. Looks like no one's around. Now's our chance to look for the Dragon Balls. The Dragon Balls. So, they actually buried them in the ground. Huh. We've got all of them now! Ah, so that's where they are. Hurry and summon that Shenron creature, you fools. Once that thing makes an appearance, I'll trash the kids and finally make my wish for immortality. Harunga appears. Harunga appears. Well, here goes. Right! Come forth, Shenron! Uh, nothing happened. What's going on? Where's... Where's Shinron? Maybe the phrase you use is different to summon him here. Damn it! What the hell are those two doing? Quillen! Someone's coming this way! <laughs> yeah, there's two of them. And they got some wicked power. One of them's that Ginyu guy! D does... <laughs> what the... Goku, did you beat Ginyu and befriend one of his men, or...? Something like that? Whoa, they dug up the Dragon Balls! How did you do that? What do you mean? Obviously, we used the Dragon Radar. The Dragon Radar? So, did you already make your wish? Well, it's the craziest thing. We tried to summon Shinron, but it just won't work. Uh, you know, there's something different about you, Goku. Uh, the smile, bro. It. That's a scouter, isn't it? Why are you wearing one of those, Goku? Krillin! That's not my dad! Huh? Gohan, what do you mean it's not your dad? I, I don't know how to explain it, but I know it's not him! This body no longer belongs to that Saiyan! I couldn't resist its power, so I took it! Wait, what did you say? <sighs> hmm? And you're... Krillin! Go on! That's not me! <laughs> wow, you actually made it this far! That's correct! 
I am the mighty leader of the Ginyu Force, Captain Ginyu! <laughs> no, it can't be. That's my dad? He swapped bodies. All this really complicates things. Go on. Krillin, I know you two have what it takes to get rid of this guy. Don't hold anything back. Really let him have it. I... I can't. You're talking as if you think they can win. Remember, this is your body. Yeah. You're right about one thing. That's my body. Not yours. As long as my mind is separated from it, you can't unleash the full power it's capable of. You fool! The great Captain Ginyu will not fall for such tricks! Give me my dad's body back! Let me join in the fight, Captain! Or I can totally make these low lives suffer! Well then, if you're looking for a fight, why don't you try me on for size? <gasps> Vegeta! We when did you? I just came for spaces. Oh, whoop that ass! Let me give it Vegeta. Please let me use Vegeta. Damn it, I'm gonna go find me. Ah! There's nobody of mine out! Hey, power, as long as my dad's mind is separated from his body. Yeah! 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 Get out my dad's body! Got a gun!
the bastard! Ah, how no. dare you! How dare you! <laughs> Looks like I'm back to being me again. What? What the hell just happened? What was that just now? That feels like my dad, all right. My dad. He's back in his own body! Yeah! Damn it! This time... This time I'm taking Vegeta's body! Uh-oh. If he switches places with Vegeta, we're all done for! Not good! Now! Your body is mine, Vegeta! Perfect! Change! Robot. <laughs> what just happened? Yes, I did it. <laughs> I turned him into a frog. <laughs> yes. Get my homie to the restoration pies. Stat. Tell me how to use the Dragon Balls. Tell me and I'll put an end to your suffering. I may not be able to kill that elder of yours, but you, on the other hand, are expendable. Consider this your final warning. Tell me how to grant my wish, or die! <laughs> it's too late for you. Dende is on his way. To meet the Earthling, he, he's going to tell them how to use the Dragon Balls. What? What? The little worm from before. Frieza likes to let you? little people go. You are merely wasting my time, are you? This is like you? the folly of his ways. I'm not picking up a signal from the Ginyu Force. No! All five of them couldn't have! They couldn't have all been defeated! No! Something must have happened between Vegeta, the Earthlings, and the Ginyu Force! And the Dragon Balls! Man! No! I, the Almighty Freezer, will be the only one to make any wishes! Not lower life forms like you! This medical machine here, it should put you back in prime condition before you know it. Robin, the sensu beans. Oh, and might as well give you some battle suits while we're at it. That way you'll at least be somewhat protected. Huh? Battle suits? You mean like that one? I don't really like how it looks. Whoa, this is crazy. It's super hey, lightweight. Hey, it feels like I'm not wearing anything at all. And these shoulder pads don't really get in the way. We have all sorts of room to move. Go on. We should head over to Guru's place while Goku's recovering. If we don't find out how to summon Shenron, then we came all the way out here for nothing. Right. Let's get going. Go find out how to activate the Dragon Balls. I am going to rest up before this fight with Frieza. Uh, okay. Someone's on the move. Wait, that power. It's Dinde. Krillin, go on. What are you doing here? Uh, well, we finally collected the Dragon Balls, but we can't do anything with them. 
So we thought we'd head to Guru's place and ask him what to do. I knew it. This is perfect. Grand Elder Guru told me to find you two and tell you how to use the Dragon Balls. You won't be able to make a wish unless you say it in the Namekian language. Namekian, huh? I guess that would explain why it didn't work before. We need to hurry. Grand Elder Guru doesn't have much time. Frieza might be on his way here as we speak. Uh, right. Oh, yeah, what about Vegeta? He said he was going to rest up, right? Yeah. He's probably still sleeping. Good. We got to make sure we're extra stealthy on the way back. Ugh. So how's Vegeta? Uh, he's still sleeping. Well, he's been in his fair share of battles recently. Now's our chance to leave him here and go make our wishes. We gotta grab the Dragon Balls and make our way out of here without waking him up. Even if Shenron wakes him up, we should still have enough time if we're far enough away. All right. It looks like Vegeta doesn't even know we're here. Yeah. Huh? Someone's coming this way. They're super fast. Yeah. It's Frieza. Hurry, did they? Do what you need to do to help us make our wishes. But, right. Takarato popurunga, puprito paro. They're glowing. And the sky, it's getting dark. Just like the Dragon Balls on Earth. You who have gathered all seven Dragon Balls, now state your wishes. I shall grant you any three wishes that are within my power. Uh, whoa! That Namekian Shinron is one generous dragon! Hurry! Tell me your wishes before Vegeta or Frieza get here! Oh, uh, right. First, ask him to bring back everyone on Earth who was killed by the Saiyans. Banda Parura, Ruti Meraru, Fan Paritsu, Kumera Tohero, Runchuro, Itash Kunspa, Pontero, Rupche! I am unable to grant that wish. I am only capable of bringing back one person at a time. Bring back Piccolo. That way you can bring back other people with their Earth Dragon Balls. Hmm. It seems they can only wish back one person at a time. Hey, let me talk to Gohan. Hurry! Okay, okay. Place your hand on my shoulder to talk to him. Thanks. Gohan! Can you hear me? It's Piccolo! Mr. Piccolo? Listen up and listen good, okay? I know what's going on there. That first wish of yours, use it to bring me back. If I'm back, then Kami will be as well. You have to trust me on this. We can use the Dragon Balls on Earth to resurrect everybody else. We can bring them back! Yeah, that's right. I totally forgot about that. And, as for the second wish, you have to make him send me to Namek. I want to make that wretched Frieza suffer slowly for slaughtering my people. I'm a lot stronger now thanks to the training I've done. I know I can beat him. You have to warp me to Namek. Okay, Mr. Piccolo. Good! Do whatever you want for the third wish. Dinde, ask him if he can bring back Piccolo. He was a Namekian that used to be on Earth. Okay, you said his name was Piccolo, right? Tetorapto Hoto Piccolo, Pupimero Papi Moposo, Patorate Morimpe, Kuri Pupas, Kuya Kirigo! 
Oltaku Horoksa Perompopo! Understood. I will grant your first wish. <laughs> Kame! Piccolo, what is this? What in the world are you up to? For our second wish, please ask him to take Piccolo, the guy we just brought back. And then warp him straight here to Namek. Okay. Tarumopara Akororu, Stenonipero, Picoloru Magaka, Tamakaroru. Consider it done. I shall grant your second wish. So, this is Planet Namek. I'm not sure why, but there's something familiar about it. Now's not the time to get emotional. I need to find Gohan and the others. I'm sensing a massive energy in the distance. Oh, it must be that monster Frieza! I sense three huge powers near there. They've got to be Gohan and the others! Shit. I thought for sure Freeze. Why is it dark outside? There's no night on this planet. What the hell is that monstrosity? Those Dragon Balls and those twerps, they're gone. That beast must be the Shenron creature those two were talking about. Duh! I can't believe they took the Dragon Balls right from under my nose. Damn them! Uh-oh. Your second wish has been granted. Now. State your final wish. Wait, he granted our wish? Then where's Piccolo? Well, you did ask to have him sent to this planet, but... but you didn't say where. D did you want me to have him sent here? Oh no, now what are we supposed to do? Ah. Uh. Oh, you actually thought you can trick me? You're going to pay for that! How could you be so stupid? Get it through your head! Frieza can't be defeated unless I'm immortal! W wait We get three wishes! So that means there's still one left! W what are you doing, Gohan? Well, now that's what I like to hear. Now then, make me immortal! Frieza's already on his way here! Hold on. Do you not have a final wish? Oh man, we're out of options at this point. Hurry, Tinde, grant Vegeta's wish! I hate to admit it, but he's our best shot at getting out of this mess. Okay, I'll ask Purunga. Yes! Finally! Frieza has no hope of beating me now. Even if I don't have the strength to beat him, I'll eventually wear him down. <laughs> okay, here goes! Oh, he died. <gasps> oh, what the? The dragons disappeared! The Dragon Balls, they're... They're stone! G Grand Elder Guru? He's gone. He finally... died. What, what do you mean? What about my immortality? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> uh, oh no. Oh, it's yes. Frieza! Well, you've really done it now, haven't you? You have destroyed my dream of attaining true immortality in the most spectacular fashion. As for the lack of response from the Ginyu Force, I suppose I have you to blame. I don't fully understand what has happened, but this is a rather surprising turn of events. How could I have foreseen the Dragon Balls turning to stone just as I was about to make my wish a reality? 
I can only imagine Vegeta's disappointment, though it pales in comparison to my own. Now that Guru is dead, is there a chance for survival dead as well? Or will Piccolo make it to them in time, with his newfound abilities, and his thirst for revenge, or his Namekian brothers and sisters? Or will Frieza crush them, palm of his hand? Tune in next time on Simple Minded Laughter.